Hi, it's Michelle and Karen from Two Blooms. We're going to make lavender soap tonight. And, and what's just, our website? Two our website is www.twoblooms.webs.com. So I've got the oils that I've cooled down. We used to use a thermometer to do the exact temperature, but after 10 years, you kind of just know what you're looking for. So I've got the oils here in the pot. I've added the essential oil blend. Uh, it's lavender, but we have made our own blend. And now I'm just gonna pour the lye in. This part is pretty self-explanatory. We've added uh, a few secret essential oils in with the lavender. Michelle is the alchemist and she's the one who will take a scent and just do amazing things with it. So now I'm just going to give it a bit of a blend with the stick blender. We've worked with this before and we know this lavender essential oil is really going to behave for us. Of course, now that I've said that, won't you go as hard as pudding? But no, so far so good. Yeah, uh, it's looking good. It's looking good. It's, so it's a, bit, it's a bit, it's bit, too, uh, bit too light, Trace, though. We want it a little bit thicker. Just until you can see. That's a bit of lavender bud just swimming in there. Don't be alarmed. I'm just going to give it a quick another blend. <laughs> I don't know if we can hear you above the whirl of yeah, the blender I just, there. I give it till I'm just really sure that it's blended well. And if I run this across, it's just the lightest trace. Probably hard to see that from the camera, but yeah, uh, that's I'm happy with that. Okay. Okay. All right. So and remember, to, uh, don't use this in the kitchen. This is only for soap. Okay, we're gonna pause and we'll be back. Hi, we're back at www.twoblooms.webs.com What we've done is we've taken the soap out of the pot. We've put about three quarters of it in a white cup. We've put the other bit in a cup with colorant at the bottom and we're just stirring it till you know it's all mixed. And I'm really happy with this color. So we're going to... It's still a pretty light tray. Actually this is... That's hmm. okay. Okay, now I'd like some of the fun, so I'm going to let Karen stand back here. Okay, you go, and I'm going to uh, stick to this bit. And and, uh, she can stick one, and I'm going to do some of the purple. So I'll move that out of the way, and I'm just going to put some purple on the bottom. We're just going to randomly, uh, randomly have fun here. I'm gonna give it a bit of a blend to the white. Okay, so she's gonna stick. How are you doing there? Still with us? Okay, I'm just gonna this give This is it gonna be a bit longer of a video for us. We normally do them quick. Let's get every last drop off the uh Oh, did you like that bit of a soap that just went flying your way? That's a little gift. It's a gift that keeps on giving, I believe. Camera's fine. We've got a new camera here, so I'm a little bit paranoid that we keep the camera. I think paranoid might be an we keep the We keep the camera nice and clean. Okay. Okay. So now so... all I'm going to do is just pour in a bit of a zigzag pattern. Yeah, looking good. I don't know how well you can see that there, but... Uh... Can you show it on top? Uh... I'm going to lift this a little bit. Okay, now we're going to do some of the purple. Oh, this is getting nice. Yeah, leave some of the fun for me. So, you can probably see that. We're just kind of layering that in there. Okay, that's probably some. what you want for the top. Yeah, that's good. Okay. Let's see. Any for the top you want me to save? Yeah, yeah, maybe a little bit. Okay, and we should uh, just okay, give I'm it gonna, the official jiggle. I'm going to give that a little bit of a swirl at the end, so. Yeah, okay, so let's do some purple now. Okay, and I've left a little bit for the top. Now you go ahead. Now this is the official okay. jiggle I call. I'm sure there's a soap making name for it. And you could get me a little stick to swirl with. Do you want? So this is getting a little bit thick, but that's okay. And we might actually have a little bit of this left over. Let's get a little bit of white going here. 
Go ahead and take all of that. Oh, that's set and up nice. And we might be left with nice. a little bit of purple. Do you want me to put the lavender blossoms uh, maybe at yeah, the very let end? Let me just do a little bit of a design here. So yeah, we're taking our time here. This essential oil blend is holding up really well. This is a good batch. This, the essential uh, oil blend is pretty consistent. This, uh, this scent is behaving very well for and us. And in case I haven't mentioned it lately, www.twoblooms.webs.com. Okay, so uh, this is a palm-free batch. And I have um, quite a few soaps that I need to make in the next few days. So I picked a recipe that um, doesn't have too many complicated oils in it. Okay, and I'm going to take the last bit of the purple, which is getting a little bit thick on us. That's okay. Wiggle needed? Sure, a little wiggle there. Okay. So we planned this design out a little bit, but we didn't kind of have anything specific um, in mind. We make lavender is probably one of the soaps we make the most often. It's one of the more popular ones for us. I always wish I had a bit of an accent when I do these videos. Lucky. But we have a Canadian accent, we've been told. Not so, even. A little bit of one, we've been told. No, not um, even. You know, things like house and mouse and mm -mm. Zed and what mm. else? We both went to school in the States, so people used to always make fun of us uh, with certain words that we'd say. But we don't anymore. But house and mouse is one of the common ones. Mm. And then people always think Canadians say A, but we don't really say it. So. Okay, you're probably getting your good okay. point. All right, there we go. So... About good. Yeah, we're getting some nice strusillation there, my nice made up word. And okay. now I'm just going to shake it so it's pretty even, and Karen's going to add some of the buds on top. Okay. Okay, so this is a bit of a long video. It's uh, going to be a 10, 12 minute video or oh, so. Oh gosh, people are going to walk away. Yeah, quite a long one for us. But And then um, uh, we'll have to show you what it looks like when it's I've cut. seen a lot of soap videos that are about 15, 20 minutes, so hopefully uh, hopefully you'll stick around for the whole or thing. Or you've gone to get refreshments. Or and then the cutting probably won't happen for probably tomorrow, because um, it's kind of later on in the day. There we and go. And we're not probably going to wait till it's all done. But we, yeah, probably tomorrow morning we can cut this just because we're doing it in the oven. So that's it for now. That's uh, Michelle and Karen signing out from uh, www.twoblooms.webs.com. Good night. We'll see you later. Bye bye. bye. Hello, we're back from twoblooms.webs.com and we're here to cut the soap today. Now we have different opinions. I like to just get the soap and start slicing it willy-nilly, randomly. Michelle is much more analytical and organized, and she likes every slice to be the same size. So today we're going to show you using our cutter. Okay, so I've got the um, the log splitter up here. I'm not using it, but it, I couldn't be bothered to take it off, so it's still on. And I've got my little mat underneath here, and I'm sounding a little bit stuffed up, so... I'm going to cut the first one. It's, oh, it's actually not that hard to cut. I thought it would be much harder to cut. So that's the first bar. It's kind of got a layered effect. And then I'm going to go get uh, my sister here to weigh it. Because I like it to be at least four ounces or a little bit more than four ounces. So I'm going to adjust this actually just a little bit while we're shooting the video here. Just a slight hair. Okay, that should be about perfect. And I won't show you the whole log. We'll show you a couple slices here. Okay, and if I can, there we go. So the top has little lavender buds on it. And that should be actually the perfect weight. And just by looking at it, it looks just about right. Just about right, okay. All right. And there's the third bar. And we'll show you the log. I don't know if we showed you the whole log. I don't know if you can see it from the camera there. Uh, so that's it there. You can see the lavender buds on top. I don't know how well you can see that. All right. 
Okay, so uh, that's about it. I'm just going to make it nice, short, and sweet um, since our making of the soap took a little bit longer. And hope you're having a great day signing out from twoblooms.webs.com. Bye!